Turning now to a disturbing story in Northern Virginia, a father was reported missing, then found dead behind his home. Police say his son killed him and buried him. This investigation is unfolding in Falls Church in Fairfax County. That's where our John Henry is tonight, live on Nevia Street, where police are still searching that backyard. John, my goodness, what are they looking for at this hour? Right now, they're still looking for more evidence, and we're told, Lorenzo, they could actually continue their work here through Friday. Locals did not expect to see Fairfax police here on the 3300 block of Nevia Street in Falls Church early Wednesday. By 10 o'clock this morning, I was walking up the street and there were four or five police cars and the tape all the way around. But six hours later, they finally learned just what these officers were up to. Police announced that they had found 78-year-old Truman Wynn buried behind this home. The department had also said it had arrested Truman Wynn's son, 19-year-old Philip Wynn, on a murder charge. We have probable cause for an arrest and uh, we, we, we made that swiftly and uh, the, the offender is where, where he should be and that's at the county jail. Police said when had last been seen Sunday before he was officially reported missing Monday. Authorities added they had been called to this home before to handle domestic disputes. One neighbor told us while Truman Wynn was nice to her, yelling inside his home was not unheard of. They had classic knock down drag out fights in that house that we've heard for years and years and years. Chief Kevin Davis said this is the fifth time this year a father, mother or a sister has been murdered by their son or brother in the county. He calls it a disturbing trend. The family dynamic has been turned upside down in, in America in the last 18 months. To what level or to what degree that played a role here today, I don't know. But I think it's fair game to, to discuss uh, the, the, the impact on all these things on such a thing as the homicide rate. Now, Lorenzo, police say there have been 18 homicides so far this year in Fairfax County. That's opposed to six this time last year. On top of that, they say they're still trying to figure out the exact manner in which Wynn was killed. John Henry W, USA 9. Yeah, just an awful story. We know you're going to stay on top of it. John, thank you.